All right, <clears throat> so let's go ahead and uh, break down the Alpha series first, okay? So this is the Alpha series. Basically, by using the 9 series, which we've talked about before, we're going to actually discover the Alpha series, okay? Double the 9 series and add the Alpha sum before the number will end up giving you the next number. So as you can see, 1 times 2 is 2, plus 1 is 3. There's your next number. All right. Two times two is four, plus three is seven. There's your next number. Four times two is eight, plus seven equals 15. One plus five equals six. There's your next number. All right. Eight times two is 16. One plus six equals seven, plus six equals 13. One plus three equals four. There's your next number. 7 times 2 is 14, 1 plus 4 is 5, plus 4 is 9, there's your next number. And as you can see, 5 times 2 is 10, 1 plus 0 is 1, plus 9 equals 10, 1 plus 0 is 1, and it starts all over again. Okay, that is your alpha series. Now, we're going to talk about, go ahead and lower this down real quick. Alright. Now. Let's talk about the next series in this, which is the Omega series. And as you will see, the Alpha and the Omega series are going to go together. Okay? The Omega is the negative. Okay? Alpha is positive, Omega is the negative. Omega series is starts with a hidden 9, because as you know, 9s are hidden. starts with a hidden 9, and it's going to be 8, 6, 2, 3, 5, and 0. All right? Now, this is really simple, because what you're going to do is you're going to start with 9, you're going to subtract the Omega from the 9 series. Okay? So... 9 minus 1 is 8. There you go. Started with 9 minus 1. End up with 8. 8 minus 2 is 6. There's your next number. 6 minus 4 is 2. There's your next number. Now 2, this is really interesting. When you start getting into the negative, you actually reverse it. So 2 is going to be 11. Okay, 1 plus 1 equals 2. So 11 minus 8 equals 3. 3, or 1 plus 2, or 12, minus 7 equals 5 and 5 minus 5 is 0. So as you can see, when you're dealing with the negative, you're almost reversing the casting the 9, and you're making it so that you are taking 2 and 3 and turning it into 11 and 12. And so instead of casting 9 and bringing it below 9, you're actually making it go above at lower numbers. Okay. Now, a lot of this is a lot of math that I'm not really that uh, advanced into. Okay. But I do understand this part. So now we have the 